200 votes for a blitz tourney. Okay, if I can win this blitz tournament, maybe I'll I'll do the hourly bullet afterwards, try and satisfy as many people as possible. But I am late joining here. No more time to waste. This is 5-0, which is a time control I don't usually play online. Usually I play 3-0 or 3 plus 1 for Tylo Tuesday. It's taking a while to get a game. Oh, do I keep Zen mode? Should I keep Zen mode? Maybe I will. Thank you, Kika Twee. I forgot I had Zen mode enabled. Let's Berserk. Uh, let me turn down this volume. Okay, so I don't know who I'm playing. Someone says no Zen, and another person says no Berserking. Well, too late for both. <laughs> Yeah, if I'm trying to win the tournament, I probably shouldn't be using Zen mode. Because I want to, like, smart berserk, basically. Okay, tucking away the queen. So I do have a lot of things controlling e5. So 95... I was going to say 95 should not be possible... Take, take. Ah, I have to calculate now. Take. Take, take, take. I just think I'm winning a pawn here. Yeah, because if we trade on C and I take with Rook, the Queen will stay supporting the Knight. Down a little bit of time. Thank you, Samsonite, gifting to Karun. Happy 34 months to Kiko Twee. Okay, so there's some tension along the C file. Uh, what do I want to do? Get the rook in play. Not sure how useful rook d8 is. Play 94. I'm imagining like queen here and the knight here. It could be a fancy way to try and trade. Uh, that's a move. Might as well take. And I could do guess the elo here too. <laughs> uh, I'm guessing like 1900. Actually, rook c1 is kind of annoying. Because I either. Oh, rook c1 is very strong. I have to play rook b8. And my queen's really misplaced here. There, there. To play rook b8. Rook c7 is probably coming. So now I'm threatening check and then check and then win the rook. Okay. Um. Gotta move a lot quicker. Uh, that was bad timing. I'm in trouble here. I lost back the pawn. It's the one thing I was not supposed to lose.
sobbed for one twelfth of my life. Let's go. Okay. Oh, what a start to the tournament. Uh, I was regretting not taking a draw at some point, but now I, I'm happy I didn't take the draw. Thank you, Tuesday's Green. Oh. What a game. Yeah, it was, it felt like Ultra Bullet towards the end. Oh, man. Okay. No Zen mode. Uh, let's Berserk. Try and keep up this win streak. We have a Grand Prix. Black's playing one of the more confrontational approaches. Useful to throw in this move, Bishop b5. Where do you get your sweater? I got this in Iceland. I got it in Iceland earlier this year, back in March. March or April. And the weather is finally getting like cool enough to to be sweater weather. This interesting approach from black. Like these pawns are very extended. Maybe a little bit overextended. If B5, maybe A4. Okay. Some nice tension here. Thank you, young Bizzle. What do we call this? I've been playing 1.g3h5 as black because of something oh. you mentioned. <laughs> uh, you're welcome, I guess. Okay, so all the pawns just got traded. It was like a zipper that just disappeared. Okay, this is attacked and this is attacked. So this defends everything. Queen defends a rook. I think the goal is to probably attack on the king side, but also to expand with d4 very soon. Like d4 and then f5. f5 will open the bishop, also maybe the rook, maybe allow for knight f5. It's looking good. Twenty-three months. Wow! Thanks oh. for all the content. Also, board sounds are pretty low. Ah, that's because oh, that's because of my extension thing. Um. Okay, let's play this move. I hope. Uh, hope the sound is better now. Checking the levels. Like, I don't want it to be too loud. Okay, can I take on g7? Knight h5. Seems very close. I think I'll play this first. I'm just preparing knight h5. I mean, it's a party on the king side. Most of my pieces are invited. F6 on tap. Black might have to play F6 to prevent me. Okay, that's a almost, I mean, that's not actually a mate threat. Knight defends. <clears throat> and now the goal is to probably sneak in with the queen. But is it winning? Oh, I'm blundering a rook. Oh, no.
Someone call an ambulance. Or we can just wait here in silence and no one has to call an ambulance. Yeah, G5 is the best move. And this actually isn't easy. Take, I don't have any mate threat anymore. Position's a little bit awkward. So I'll play this. Now I wanted to sack the rook and then sack my queen and then mate. But it's not meant to be. All right, let's play this. I have to be really careful here. This is almost crushing. I might be in trouble again. I have to defend the pawn. Like I want to play this move, but it doesn't work. Yeah, this move. Okay, so I'm defending f6. I'm over defending the knight too, so preparing rook h3. Oops. Okay, here we go again. I'm going to be down two pawns. And I'm stuck. I'm completely stuck. Oh man. I had to unpin myself. That's a sad square for my queen trying to not get mated. I'm also trying to checkmate on a8. Looks like I'll win on time. Okay. I was a little bit faster there. Another really close game, though. Oh, man. Uh, Smokehouse says, Wednesday night about to be lit. It's already lit, bro. Oh, man. Yeah, black was winning there. Like, my attack didn't actually really pan out to anything. But life goes on. Berserking goes on. Welcome back to Late Night Life Alert. As long as I keep winning, I'll keep berserking. I mean, both games so far have come down to me having not much time left. Queen C2, I think C5 is... A proper approach. I don't really want to trade queens, so I think bishop d7 and, and knight c6. Oh no, my pawn. Yeah, if knight takes pawn, I, I play queen a5 and then win the knight. 
Nice little tactic. And the queen has to find a different square. And there might be e4 coming. Ooh. I shouldn't be taking too long. It's an interesting position. <laughs> like keep kicking the queen. I guess there's a line queen d2, bishop e4, knight c3, queen a5. Which defends and attacks. If queen d3, maybe knight c b4. Queen b3. Okay, I'm going to sack the pawn. If white takes the pawn, then knight cb4 looks nice. Wow, so white allowing some discoveries. I mean, this move, queen here, it's not super clear. Okay, felt like I had to defend there first. So now I, oh, I'm not actually threatening that either because queen takes e3. So I burned a lot of time looking at a nonsensical line. At least my pieces are happy and decently centralized. Reminds me of a like Yugoslav dragon type thing. E4 is maybe coming. And then F5. Okay, defending. I might be threatening e3 here. There's a nice little kind of triangle with uh, the things. Oh, e3 was not a threat because the thing was pinned. I just blundered that move. Okay, another... <laughs> another comeback story, hopefully, in the making. Um, let's play bishop here first. Gonna avoid trades. Well, the rook d1. It's not ideal. I had bishop c7. I missed a chance. I want to play g5. Very shaky position. I what was that move? Okay. 
Okay. I don't think we're getting a miracle here. Ah, yeah, what to do? <laughs> okay. 23 minutes left. 31st place. Berserking maybe not the best option. But the goal is to is to try and win the tournament. Did we just change their design there? Okay. This is gonna turn into like super aggressive chess now. Gonna play some maybe slightly more dubious openings to to hopefully try and win more quickly. Every game has been a struggle. Yeah, this is some kind of England Gambit declined. It's white about to castle queenside. Wow. Okay, being super aggro here. Yeah, this is full destructive chess. Instructive chess will come later. The idea is to play a4 and b3. Maybe some idea knight c4. Would love to see a Stafford at some point. Yeah, me too. There's been no opportunities for Stafford so far. Uh-oh. Okay, this is okay. Maybe a uh, C5 coming. I still want to keep on storming. Do I sack the queen? I feel like I might have to. Oh no, my queen. <laughs> uh, it's interesting though. Because I have the light squared bishop, which is pretty strong in this position. And material wise, I have rook and bishop for queen. So it's not like I'm down so much. Play this move, threatening this. But it's not great that we're simplifying. Ooh. Problem is queen takes e4. Could take on g2. And now there's this battery with a bishop, okay. Opponents saw this diagonal, but not this diagonal. Someone call an ambulance. Still a matter, okay. Still trying to win games as quickly as possible now. 20th place, leader has 24 points. It's a clean score. That was fortunate. Like my opponent played well there to 
at least win the queen and well, it was probably objectively better after I lost my queen. Welcome back to Young Derry. Good evening, Eric. Okay, I think I'm I'll I'll be berserking the rest of the games to at least try and have a running. Thank you, Yuri in the house. How's it going? Shout out to Yuri. Yeah, so the way to play aggressively here is to just go all out on the king side. D5 might happen. I'm okay with D4 and then knight E2. I might look to play G4. Like, sack the pawn to open the file. Opponent taking their time. Why is there an ambulance in your name? Yeah, I illegally changed my name to Eric Rosen Ambulance. Because we have to call one so frequently. Usually not for me, but sometimes for me. Okay, so this is a very classic um, kind of King's Indian type structure. I have the pawn chain pointing this way, black has a point, pawn chain pointing that way. My goal is to eventually play g5. Maybe knight h5. Okay, the king is trying to uncastle. The king is now tied down to the pawn. If g6, I take, take, and then take some x-ray vision with the rook. Queen g3, probably the next move. The king's still running. Hmm. Oh, this is a free pawn. Oh, maybe I can... Like attack from all directions. Almost didn't see that. There's so much focus on this quadrant of the board. Opponent having some connection issues. Can I... I have to save the rook. I want to play g6, but not quite in time. Man, it's so close to working. So be patient for another move. I really wanted to take on e5 with the queen, Zach, and do things, but I have to have some self-control. Okay, I have to still keep in mind of the open file. And G6 will make things spicy. Okay. Got the back rank. And now attacking from multiple directions. Knight's pinned, bishop's pinned. These rooks are stuck. Yeah, everything's pretty much playing a role here. If black doesn't take the knight, then knight g6 is coming. If black takes the knight, 
I'll win this back. First forcing the king here. And it should be made in like maybe three more moves. Okay, that was nice. I feel good game. So 17th place, 12 points. I'm 12 points behind first, so I need to need to get in at least three more games. Might be difficult. Because games can take up to like seven. Like if, if I berserk, they take up to seven and a half minutes. Okay, new opponent. Oh, playing this person who beat me earlier. Um, but I was black earlier, so it's slightly different. Going for more open position. My idea to play d4. And this resembles a French now. It might close down on the queen side. I'd like to play knight g5. Maybe queen g4 and push the h-pawn. I have to keep in mind f5 as well. It's interesting. I'm trying to throw the kitchen sink at my opponent. Oh, that's a good move. Yeah, it didn't really get much there. Okay, this could be a long battle.
I don't know if black has a way to stop the pawn. Because I'm controlling all these squares. And the question, can black make use of this pawn? Ah. This is going to be a draw. Check. No, I think I still have winning chances. I also have losing chances. Oh no, this it's probably a draw. And I'll try and fight though. Have to run up to G5. Opponent's waiting for me to accept the draw. Bob. Always nice to think on the opponent's time. Yeah, this is kind of risky. Ah. Yeah, this is a draw. Will Black try and flag me, though? Okay, that's a draw. Uh, what to do? To queen g5, I wonder if I could have avoided the repetition. But there's no shelter for the king. Hello, how are you? I am fine, and you? I'm good, and you? Welcome back, Sir Ripoff Mabel. Okay, not the most successful tournament. See if I can play one more game. Maybe finish top 10. Oh, it's interesting. The flares don't appear in the list. I think a few days ago they appeared. The Lee Chess keeps changing things. Okay, final game. Playing Mark. Triple three. Stafford Gambit time. Might be the first Stafford of the stream. The first Stafford of the tournament. Also the last Stafford of the tournament. This line is known to be a little bit better for white. Can still try and poke and prod. I'm being very aggressive here. That's a fine move. I'm going to be also maybe creative here. I'm going to sack the pawn to just develop my bishop. This is not something I would normally do, but it's interesting. Um, like castle queenside. Bishop e7 first. The knight wants to come to f4 probably, even here. 
Might keep the king in the center. Have to watch out for d7. Yeah, this this might be asking for too much. <laughs> I mean, the idea is f5 and then knight f4. And it looks kind of cool. Can I... Oh no, my queen. Okay, so I just sacked a knight, but... Rook g is a big threat. Check. King f1, bishop g2. Maybe queen h3 first. But then the king is running. So where is my thing? Yeah, I might be in trouble here. I have to try queen h3. Rook g2. Yeah, at least we're getting a fun game. Queen d3 would threaten. I mean, my queen does defend from a distance. Having a hard time calculating. My queen's like castle. And bishop h4. Super, super tricky. My king's not safe here. White's king should not be safe here. I'll take a pawn. I don't think this game will count for the tournament, despite my efforts to try and win quickly. Okay, good job to Asganga winning the tournament. So 92. I think that's a good move. I mean, if I check rook f1, the king's coming to d2. So my plan is to open the d-file. Bishop a6. Trying to calculate this. King d2, take. I think that's okay. There's a line like bishop a6. Even this line too. Because yeah, once I take there will be a pin. Even if the bishop was on a6, I'd still go into this line because my king gets deflected, the queen would defend the rook. But now, you know, I could play this hoping I, I go for queen f2 and forget about the bishop. King f1 might be the best try. I'm not seeing the mate. That's also a move. Okay, let's we'll simplify. I'm up rook for bishop.
Okay. Good game. Yeah, I'm actually curious what the engine will say about this game. Even in... Okay, Black's better in this position. King f1... Yeah, King f1, Queen h1, and then like Bishop g1. But Black has enough firepower. Yeah, the opening was perhaps a little bit questionable. Bishop takes f7, best move. Idea queen f3, oof. Queen h4 is not the craziest idea ever. Okay. Should I move on to another tournament? Or should we look at the graph first? Yeah, it was much worse. I was kind of hoping for this and then checkmate. It's such a random checkmate, but it's uh, it's a nice pattern. My opponent took the knight. Best move, rook takes f4. Yeah, I could have been in trouble. To at GC at 1, oh, hey, it's Irene. For my sub -gift. Thank you, G Cook. Entering month three. So yeah, if you're just joining, I ran a poll at the be beginning of the stream People voted for Blitz Chess, so I just played the Blitz Arena. But in second place in the poll was Bullet Chess, and I failed to win that last tournament, but maybe maybe I can have some hope in this tournament. This will be a bit faster, probably a bit crazier too, even though okay, the games I just played were relatively crazy. Have you played Ben OTB? I have. Oh, let me... I really should change this uh, setting. Okay, no more berserking. Wait. I meant to join the... the bullet tournament. I just joined a blitz tournament? I just joined a blitz tournament. Oops. <laughs> okay, let me... Uh, let me, I guess, finish this game and then <laughs> join the tournament I intended to. I clicked the, the tournament that looked the most attractive. The, it was highlighted blue. I don't think I'll do both. It's too hard to simul bullet and blitz. Yeah, rook b8 and b4. Okay, save the bishop. Yeah, this position is probably close to equal. I still have ideas of b4. Yeah, maybe I can push for something. Oops! I hung a rook, but opponent missed it. Opponent wanted to trade queens. <laughs> Oh man, not in the best form today. Let's start with this. Yeah, I want to drive the rook away from attacking the pawn. We're still trading. Walk the king up to g6. Leaving the tension. Okay, now. I mean, I'll take with check. Oh, no, I won't take with check. I think this is a good transformation, though. White's almost in Zugzwan. I have active rook versus passive rook. Question is how to make progress. Uh, 
Okay, not getting mated, thankfully. My pawn wasn't here, I get mated. Maybe there's some idea to put the rook on d3. Preventing rook b8. Yeah, I think white should have brought the king to d2. It was still possible. Okay, now... There's that move. The check... It's still tricky. But it's looking good. Or is it? I feel like we've both misplayed this endgame. But now it's going well. This is a long fight. Okay. Okay. Oh, that was a, a long game. All stemming from joining the wrong tournament. What's up, Ross of us? Welcome back. Oh, you're just in time to witness hopefully some more Saffir Gambits. To find the right tournament. Okay. So this is the hourly bullet arena. The goal is to win the tournament. I'm joining about nine minutes late. 18 minutes left. It's 27 minutes long. So I'm get a solid 18 minutes of bullet chess. Playing. Let me uh, disable the setting real quick. Game display. One's treating this like ultra bullet. Like in bullet, you can still kind of take your time. Hi. Hello. Welcome back to Phileas. I think the goal is to put the rook here and then still sack. Maybe even end up sacking the queen. I 
Uh, okay, let's bring the knight in. Also, my son, the emote for now says hi, Ross. One. Oh no, Ross. my queen. Oh no. Someone call an ambulance. Oh wait, actually, my queen. I need to play Rook H1 too. I thought I was meeting. <sighs> okay, it's still okay. Which is not the most efficient. Okay, <laughs> not my proudest game. Oh dear. Oh, hello to your sun emote. All right. No Stafford. Still trying to play aggressively. And knight. Yeah. Attacking the knight. Gonna try and open the H file. The knight was uh, was bait there. Black the queen. Okay, staying clean. Even maybe with not the cleanest of games. Um, berserk. Berserking is risky in bullet chess, but maybe it'll pay off. Okay, that's why fractions of seconds exist for moments like that. Okay, Berserking paid off. Barely. So 15th place. A leader doing well. Okay, we have the same opening as previously.
Okay, this game is a bit cleaner. Plenty of time. Okay. On a berserking streak. Welcome back to Andrew. How's it going? Yeah, if you're just joining, had some blitz and now some bullet. Opponent wanted to play the Ponziani there. Oops, we should have taken the knight. Okay. Okay. Uh, getting the job done. Not so much time. That's five. Uh, that's three berserk wins in a row. Have to do what I can to catch up. I have a stone wall. Uh, heading straight towards the end game. I'm up on time now. So that worked out. And White's playing solidly, just a little bit, uh, play a little bit too slowly. I'll sack the rook. He's winning the knight. Okay, third place. It's still eight points out of first. What's the line here? Queen one. Oh, this is a classic one. Um, supposed to take. Don't think I got what I wanted. I have 13 seconds left.
Okay, that worked out. Second place, the berserking will continue. Oh, the Urasov Gambit. That was not a good move. I don't know what opening we just played. I'm down a pawn. I'm going to win the pawn back though. But then I'm going to lose it again. Oh, I have a fork maybe coming. Oh no, my pawns. Attacking this. Okay, opponent saw the mate threat. Okay, got the dirty flag. Not so clean though. In first place, the berserking continues. Playing cold death. Haven't played a London in a while. This is muscle memory taking over. Going super aggro. No, that was a mouse slip. Ah, uh, oh no, my keyboard. Keyboard's low on battery. What to do? Oh, it's going to be close because Vera's playing. I think I need to get at least one more game, maybe two. It's risky again, but let's go for it. Vera passed me. I need to win this game. Down two pieces.
Let me be the first to congratulate you on 250 subs Eric. You deserve it. Thank you kind person. Can you be the first to console me about this game too? Yeah, okay. There's still time. Oh no, my amazing berserking streak. <laughs> There's still time. Okay. Oh no. Oh, that's the tournament. I had my chances there too. I may have missed meat. Why do I have a knight? Okay. I was trying to promote to knight with mates, but uh didn't quite work. Blocks my queen. Okay. Well that was still fun. Missed out a little bit. Real quick. I just wanna see if I missed any mates. I was calculating uh, King G1 takes here and then this checkmate. But maybe I should have taken with Queen here. Ah, uh, yeah, this would have been forcing Queen F1 and then Rook H7. Okay. So, um, yeah, I had a nice mix of Blitz and Bullet. I could end things with Puzzle Racer. Puzzle Racer is a fun feature. allows allows people to compete. Um, a couple people asking for Wordle. Like independently, too. So I just shared the link in chat. The first 10 people get to play. OK. Where is Roxy? She's with my parents. She's not my, uh, she doesn't stay with me all the time. Okay. So good luck to everyone. Oops. A lot of, uh, things to address here. Oops. Ah, I just made in one.
Ja. Ah, smart kid. Good job. Well played. Got to 74. JG in third. Okay, let's do another one. Do a few of these. Again, if you want to join, click the link. Looks like everyone's joined. Ten, nine, eight, seven, there we go. Six, five, four, I used to play three, Sudoku. Two, Not so much recently. One, zero. Struggling with the mouse here. Ah, I could have taken the bishop. Which rook? Oh, bishop f3. Classic one. What is this one? Oh, rook d8. Da. Oh, it's close. Hamlet champion. 74. Okay, let's do one more. New game. This might be the last one. Okay. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, Good luck to everyone. 4, 3, 2, 1. Zero. Try and be clean here. What is this one? Ah. Uh. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. The queen takes e1, knight c4. Okay. It's my highest score of, of tonight. So, yeah, I think I'm done with chess for now. Uh, thanks, everyone, for tuning in.